Today, Rag and myself can kill a total of 10,000 combat levels, meaning if one of us kills Vorkath, for example, we have 9,268 combat levels left. All the food, pots, and gear we get dropped will be used for the final fight. Yikes! You think my knees are crusty? Right. End it. Thank you, boy. End them all. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Bs and Gs of super satisfied. satisfied. All right, guys, the first thing I'm going to go ahead and do is kill Revenant Imps. Um, because they drop manta raised one to two, one in 16. So we can get ourselves a load of food together. They also drop all the other blighted stuff like vengeance sacks, um, ice sacks, and of course, you know, restores, super restores and stuff like that. So it seems like a really good place to start. They're only level seven as well. So we can kill a load of them and not really worry about going through our combat levels too much. Um, so yeah, that's where we're going to go and start. I'm gonna hop in and uh, see how this goes. I'm just gonna three item it because we're gonna kill them. We're gonna one hit them, whatever. Um, so I thought I'd just go like this and uh, yeah, not really risk anything. If I get attacked by a PKR, I'll probably just let myself die and just run back. And first kill, I get two crumb ones. So that's pretty nice. And kill three and four, two blighted anglerfish and a blighted super restore, three of them. I don't think I'm going to bring three. I think max I'll bring is two, probably only one. But boom, I mean, that is from four kills. Already starting to look like we've got a sick inventory there. You've got to be fucking with me. <laughs> You've got to be fucking with me. <laughs> Kill ten. Kill ten. <laughs> we get a dragon plate skirt. Oh my god. What is the chances of that? What the fuck? One in 6k? One in 6k, B's and G's. Madness. I want to get some Venge Sacks as well, so I'm happy to see those. Okay. You know, you love to see it. You love to see that. A massive thank you to Raycon for sponsoring today's video. Raycon earbuds come at half the price of other top audio brands. But they sound just as good, and they come with some awesome features. The first being this case you get with every single purchase, which charges up the buds right in there, and also has a little thing here where you can tag it onto anything so you don't lose it and with every single purchase you get all of these silicone tips which make sure that it's going to fit your ear perfectly and not fall out they're excellent for doing like conference calls and stuff like that a lot of the time i'm driving or out with the dog and being able to just jump on discord and talk to people through the mic and listen to them is awesome and one thing that surprised me, especially when I've been out on the dog walks, is when it's a bit windy or rainy, I'm a bit worried that people won't be able to hear me properly. But every single time, they're like, no, we can't even hear the rain or the wind. So, well done, Raycon. Raycon also knows that in this economy, every purchase needs to be perfect. They offer buy now, pay later options, pay as little as $18 at checkout. They also offer free domestic shipping. They have an easy and free return guarantee, so you don't need to worry about whether or not you're going to enjoy them. And they have over 50,000 five-star reviews. The noise isolation is brilliant, and it's great that they're water and sweat resistant if you're using them in the gym. If you want to get yourself 15% off your Raycon purchase, go to buyraycon.com slash linksocarina. All right, we're up to 12 food right now. I've killed 43 imps, so actually a lot more than I uh, anticipated me killing because we still got to get a load of food uh, together. But also got probably enough vengeance sacks for the fight. I mean, I'll still hope that I get a few more, but 13 probably should do. Um, so quite happy to see those. Um, I don't think I'm going to go for the ancient ice axe. I will pick it up, but I, I just can't see myself going down that route. Um, so unlikely to see me do that because I've got range in mind. With this bad boy, I have range in mind. All right, that's the first inventory done. Um, got myself some rune bars there, which aren't going to be useful. We can't do any skilling in this challenge, so no help there. But we got ourselves 10, 15 food. Uh, 18 venge sacks, which is great, um, and those super stores as well. So just got to go back, grab a few more bits of food, and then I'll be good to go. All right, there we go. 128 revenant imps. As you can see, we got ourselves 14 anglers, 10 mantas, um, and then 14 karam ones. But obviously, uh, we'll go with the 24 of the good food, and then probably like four, maybe three karam ones, depending on what else I bring in my inventory. All right, guys, 10,000 total combat levels we can kill until the end of this pvp challenge and we have to get the best setup i want to focus 
on food first. I want to get a full inventory of food. I want to know what I'm doing with food. I don't want to have to worry about food. And where I want to do that is, of course, Revenants, because I can get Blighted food, as well as, hopefully, some other upgrades as well. I was going to say let's start the timer, but no timer needed on this one. So after a little bit of contemplating, I decided to go for the dragons. This is my second kill here. They are a very high combat level, but when we get only one, what? That's kind of lame. Come on. Um, even though it might not be the best specifically for food, again, I do really, really, really want to try to get a few other gear pieces and then I can kind of round those off in other places. So I'm not just getting food and then having no gear whatsoever, but I will keep track and... I'll, I'll try not to use too many at Revenants here. But when we get drops like that, that's what we like to see. All right, this is kill number 10. Please have something to show for this. Please. Okay, I mean, I'll take the Super Restore. This is how much food we have so far. A lot slower than I imagined. I got two Rune Warhammers. I guess that's my best weapon in the fight right now. Okay. There we go. There we go. All right, so we're probably going to bank after this kill right here. This will be my 16th kill. I actually originally only wanted to kill around 10 of these, but after looking at the drop rates for armor pieces, Revenant Dragons are by far, per combat level, and just in general, the best things to kill in order to get drops. Now, when it comes to food, I just saw a white dot up there. I'm going to see if I can get this kill. When it comes to food, that is not true. It's best to kill just imps. Imps drop it. Ooh, onyx bolt tips. Uh, and crambons. You will take those. Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. We got it. We got it. We got We got the log. We got the log. But it's best just to kill the level 7 implings because they drop the bladed food as secondary drops incredibly commonly and like all the revenants do. But I want upgrades. So I'm taking a look how easy it is to go magic right now by getting ice sacks. I mean, you can just kill the imps and get ice sacks really, really, really commonly just like you can with food. So if you get your food, get it through imps, you're probably gonna get a bunch of ice sacks by the end of it as well. So magic is really easy. I still wanna go down the melee route because I, ha I have my eyes set on melee. I just gotta make sure that I get some sort of magic defense now and kind of throwing a little bit of a wrench in my plan because magic defense isn't gonna be the easiest thing to get. But yeah, I wanna stick with melee. I'm going for it. We're getting some food. We're not getting the drops we want, but at least we're getting food with all these drops. No, the one thing that I have that I can bring to a fight and I get a dupe already. <sighs> yes, just complain. Oh, don't want to get attacked. That looked like a rev killer. I don't like to risk it. Oh my God, room plate legs. Oh my God, room plate legs. I just don't want to leave this place. I feel bad that I'm staying here so long, but I'm getting everything I need right now. There's just no reason to leave. I mean, I guess the more things I get, the less likely I am for upgrades. So I probably should definitely leave soon. Ugh, it's just a weapon I'm worried about. These guys definitely drop the best weapon at the most common rate. At least I'm getting armor though. So I really can't complain. All right, I'm off to the crazy archeologist. Uh, we're going to have some, some of our combat levels are going to be drained pretty quickly here, but there are a few things that I'd be happy to get. Um, one would be obviously the RCB, um, a power army would be pretty cool, a red dehyde body as well, because if I can just passively get the red dehyde body, I might not go for a black dehyde body. Kill number one, and we get mud runes. Not what I wanted to see. Things haven't been going great, guys. We're seven kills in with pretty much nothing. Yeah absolutely nothing that i can bring to the fight or help me um so yeah that is like over 1400 combat levels right there on top of the uh nearly 900 we had before so yeah i could really do with uh seeing at least something usable like a power army you know even that just to, just so i know i'm not wasting these combat levels hey i finally got something useful amulet of power so we can take that to the fight which is nice still no rune crossbow or red dehyde body um, 14 kills in now, so the uh, the combat levels really are starting to uh, to mount up. But the the rune crossbow it needs to happen. It's it's integral to the plan. There is the red dehyde body, so we've got that to add to the list. 21 kills though, so we are really starting to burn through numbers now. Rune crossbow in the next few kills. 
some runite bolts, and then I might have some kills left over to do some stuff. Uh, also, been getting a few sharks. I've got four sharks from uh, the Crazy Ark, so they might replace a couple of the Karamb ones that I got earlier as well, just so we've got a bit more food um, for the fight. It's another red dehyde body. Not what I wanted to see at all. Another amulet of power, <laughs> and with 31 kills in, so we are six kills dry now. Hey, there we go. 36 Crazy Archaeologists. <laughs> Fuck. I was not planning on losing that many. I'll tell you that. That is a lot of combat levels lost. I need to work that out. I'm sure there'll be a graphic on screen. So you guys see it instantly, but I have no idea how much I've just wasted there. Oh my god. I need bolts, and I need them quick. I decided to call it, and I'm going to kill some imps to get the food just like this. We left off with 18 pieces of food from the Revenant Dragon, so it's not going to be a lot of imps at all. Like I said, it's really, really, really common. But from the Revenant Dragons, we killed 27 of them, and that was 3,645 total levels. So a big chunk, but rune full helm, rune plate legs, rune kite, and I mean... I hope not to bring this to the fight, but a backup weapon of a rune mace. That would be disgusting to bring. So that is 27 pieces of food in total. At the very least, in my invo, I will have vengeance sacks. I also got two from dragons, so I have 11 sacks. It's probably enough for the fight, but I wasn't really going for them. Just happily got them in the process, so I'll gladly take them. But that is the food all sorted for the fight. And that was 39 implings. 39 times 7... That's 273, and that's gonna be 3,918 in total. My next monster is Rune Dragons, level 380. I thought about this for a really, really long time. The thing is, if I keep killing the Revenant Dragons, I'm gonna start getting all the drops that I've already gotten. It's just the weapons that would have held out for there, and there's no guarantee I get them, of course. But here, Almost every common drop is an upgrade. Rune plate body I don't have. Rune long sword, rune mace, rune scimitar, dragon plate legs, dragon plate skirt, rune med helm. Those last three are quite rare, but all the other ones are below 1 in 18. And I am gonna cross my fingers and hope that I can get something really, really nice in just a few kills. Even if I get one of those upgrades I just listed in like four or five kills, I will take that. Well, we definitely want to go on lunge there. Come on, first kill. Just give me something. Just give me something. It's okay. It's okay. We'll try again. We'll try again. Kill number two. Kill number two. It's an upgrade. It's not the upgrade I wanted, but it is, in fact, an upgrade. Oh, Rune Simi, four kills. I mean, again, it's not really the item I wanted to see. I was hoping for a Rune Plate body. But um, I will take that. Like, it's still an upgrade. It's an upgrade over that one as well. That was four kills. That's deadly. Four kills. 380 times four. That's 1.5k. 1 1,520. I'm going to stop there. Because I can't just rely on going 14 kills for a room play body. I will drain everything I have. In total, I now have spent 5,438 combat levels. All right, so as I mentioned earlier, we're going to go over to Demonic Gorillas. Hopefully, we can get the drop. It's going to be tough because they are combat level 275. So each kill is, again, just going to take so many combat levels out. If I add everything together right now... I have 1,760 combat levels left, so it's going to be really touch and go here, whether we can get lucky or not on the KC, because I that's not going to give us 20 kills, and it's 1 in 20 to get these. I really don't know what I'm going to do if I don't get the bolts. If I get close to not getting the bolts, I might go over to Chaos Druids and get Mithril bolts. <laughs> And, I mean, if it's really bad, maybe we can kill something really low level that drops, like, iron or steel bolts and get it that way. I don't know. Anyway, um, let's go kill the demonic gorillas and see how this goes. Oh, my God. I got runite bolts first drop. I got, I got it first drop. But I died. <laughs> <laughs> I had two of them on me, and I was like, I'll just quickly, I'll just quickly kill... <laughs> This, uh, this demonic gorilla. <laughs> and then I'll get on to the other one. But we got it. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, my. That's so embarrassing to have in the video. But at least we got the bolts. First drop. That makes up for the, uh, makes up for the, uh, runite crossbow. 
drop being just a little bit shit for us. <laughs> Guys, a whopping 55% of you aren't subscribed to the YouTube channel. I'd really appreciate it if you hit that sub button and click the bell. That way you'll never miss a new upload. Oh, and like the video. Thanks. Oh, I'm happy and embarrassed at the same time. It's a very, very odd sensation. But yeah, I, I didn't really explain it properly there. So I had two on me in multi and I stepped out to get away from a boulder and then they were both attacking me and it only had a little bit of life left. So I was like, fuck it, I'm just going to do it and I'll risk that I take a few hits here. And yeah, it just completely slapped me up. So <laughs> that's what happened. There we go. Load of stuff on the floor. Let's loot all of that. Let's get this on. Or as much of it as we can on and take everything before I get messed up completely where well, the runite bolts there they are beautiful take those oh perfect I was really worried we were gonna get no bolts there but 1kc beautiful and I lost half a mil fuck so I just got my first crazy art kill and I think I'm gonna stay here I've been really thinking about what I'm gonna do and the, the big problem with this challenge is no matter what monster I kill, it eats away at the 10,000 so freaking fast. And I don't think the crazy archaeologist has the best upgrades, but there is a lot of useful upgrades that I can use in the fight. A power ammy, a red D high top, even rune knives. If I get rune knives, that is a ranged weapon where if Link is going magic, I can at least put some damage back. It drops a prayer pot, and then of course the rune crossbow, which... I'll be honest, I don't really think I could find a way to use that in a fight unless I got it really, really quickly, which could happen, like right now. Onyx Bolt tips. <laughs> nope. The wrong type of red dragon hide. I want the body. Give me the body. We got something. Amulet of power. We can say the crazy arc wasn't a complete waste. That's extra attack. Uh, I think very extra slightly defense. Does give defense, right? So little de- Oh. Yeah, so little defense and some prayer. So maybe a few more kills, but I don't think I'm going to be here much longer. You're joking. You're joking, right? You're, you're actually joking. Oh my gosh. Mm, how many kills is that? How many kills is that? That's nine. We're getting one more. We're getting one more and I'm gone. All right, come on. Make it worth it. Make it worth it. Make it... I said make it worth it. He gave me this stupid hat. This stupid fucking hat. All right, for my last, well, possibly last monster, it's going to be warp jellies. The reason for that is they drop both a rune full helm and a rune kite shield. Um, they're not a crazy high level, 120, 112 combat, sorry. I did look at doing the wilderness cave ones because they are just like so much better. Um, but you need to be on task they're 1 in 32 to get a rune kite shield, and I think they're like 1 in 64 to get a uh, rune full helm. They would have been amazing to do, but yeah, you need a task, and I unfortunately don't have a jelly task right now. So the next best thing is the warp jellies here. The reason I'm going warp jellies over like another thing is just because they drop the two items that could be useful um, for me. They do also drop mithril boots as well, which I'll take because right now we don't have any boots for the fight. Um, so yeah, we'll kill them. We'll see what we get. Hopefully we get a little bit lucky and we can get both rune items, but yeah, we'll see. We don't have too many kills here. This is going to be kill number six. I think we're going to get 13 total, so just about coming up to halfway of how many we can kill here. It's not looking great, but to be fair, I'm just happy we've got the rune crossbow, enough bolts, and a pretty decent setup in terms of range and defense. So even if we don't get anything here, I'm still super happy. That's going to be kill number seven. Yeah. Looking unlikely. Looking very unlikely. There's the mithril boots. So we'll take that. It is going to give us negative range bonus, but it does give like 10 plus slash, 9 plus crush. So if he is going melee, it's super useful. And we have three kills left. So that's what's going down. All right, this is going to be the last kill. I might have a few combat levels left over. I'll see if I can do anything with it. No drop there. Let me work out how many combat levels I've used. And then I'll see if maybe we can pull something. I don't know if this is the only place to kill elven archers. I will look that up in a sec. This is just where... I knew one was. I thought there was more up here, but uh, yeah, we're going to kill Elven Archers because we have two and a half thousand points. We can't really be YOLOing points unless we really don't want to show up with any body slot in the fight. So I am here to go for a green dehyde body and or the green dehyde chaps. The body being one in 32, the chaps being one in 42. 
Ultimately, to find a body that is a lot better than a green dehyde body, even if it's just a melee body like an Addy plate body or a room plate body, is very hard because either it's really rare or the monster is just incredibly high leveled and I will blow through the 2.5k so incredibly quickly. So we're going the modest route and hopefully with 2,500 points, less now because we've killed some, but with 2,500 combat level points, we can snag some magic defense and fill in that body slot. So fingers crossed, guys, because if he's going magic, I feel like I might be a bit fudged. Holy shit! Holy shit, we got it! How many kills? Seven kills! Seven kills. Seven kills. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know if I'll go for the chaps now, because it's rarer and... I don't think the chaps would be too beneficial because I'll have to sacrifice food because I still would bring my leg switch. Hmm. Let me think about this. All right. I have 29 combat levels left. So one thing I'm going to do is get the guaranteed cape from the highwayman. Might as well. And then I think I'm going to try and get like a bronze med helm or some, something like that just to fill the helm slot in. Um, because yeah, after that, I can't remember what level they are. I think they're level five, the highwaymen. So we're going to have what, 24 combat levels after this. So yeah, it's, uh, it's a case of just trying to get anything to fill the slot. Now we need the one the oh, fuck. I can't remember which one drops it. One doesn't. And the other does. I think it's the one without the hood. Better fucking be. Otherwise I'm wasting. I'm pretty sure it is. I, I think he's, he's a faker. He's a faker. That guy Drop me the cape, Drop me the cape. Yeah, it's beautiful. Um, if we take the fire cape off. Yeah, we get we get slight defensive bonuses off that. It was a guaranteed item, so might as well take it. All right, and then we're going to go upstairs and kill these two children's parents. I don't know if that's going to make it into the cut. Why is that? What? <laughs> like, like, why is there someone up here doing this? It's so odd. So odd. Okay, well, apparently people sit up here and kill things. Um, these two drop a bronze med helm one in 64 both of them so we're gonna get ourselves 12 kills here to see if we can get a bronze med helm earth talisman all right these are the last two kills there's one we get harolander no thank you and this is the last kill and i will hit exactly 10,000 combat levels with this one and we didn't get it no worries Let's go to the bank and I'll show you the setup. Guys, I tried so hard to stay away from any kind of monster that a huge combat level and I didn't want to go to Vorkath, but genuinely, with only 2,000 more to go, 2,000 combat levels, there really isn't any solid upgrades I could get unless I YOLO something. And the one thing that I've been saying that I, that I really feel like I'm lacking is a weapon and we can get the Dragon Battle Axe or the Dragon Long here. So here we are. We have enough points to YOLO to Vorkath and then have a little over 400 left over. So that's what we're doing. Not very good first drop there, is it? This is why I hate this boss. Hate this boss. What kind of drop is that? Come on, the last Vorkath kill. Give this to me. Give this to me. <laughs> Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. 428 combat points left. We're going to YOLO it at the crazy arc and see if we can get anything in two kills. That's all we have is two kills. Kill number one. Mud runes. And the last kill of this PvP challenge. Give me the red dehyde body. It's funny. In one of the clips, I said I want a prayer pot, but I forgot that I literally got tons of blighted super restores. So if anything, that's kind of pointless. All right, guys, let's get our gear together. Hell and see what we got. Here we go. That's what we managed to pull together. I am so happy we got this dragon plate skirt because I think I would have been in real trouble without that. We'd probably be going without any leg slot here. And of course, getting the runite bolts on the first drop was huge as well. Going dry on the rune crossbow wasn't great. Wasted a lot of combat levels there. We got the power army. I'm feeling pretty happy with this, to be honest. Uh, over 100 in every defense bonus i feel like magic was very very viable for this uh for this challenge whether you wanted to go down the blighted sack route or just get a you know get a staff and get runes as drops or something like that um yeah i feel like having that plus 38 magic defense is beautiful 109 range attack as well hopefully we just tear through whatever he's got if he's going magic he's completely fucked um and if he's going range i'd be interested to see if he could beat this setup Possibly, maybe if you just went for some more 
planar items or maybe MSB or something like that. I don't know. I guess MSB would have been a fairly good shout. But yeah, I feel pretty confident with this. I am literally a free-to-play PK right now. Literally a free-to-play pk -er, minus the inventory, of course. But yeah, this is what we're rocking. Not really sure what to make of it. The more I think about it, the, the more I keep telling myself that this is an all right setup and that to get better than this, you had to get extremely lucky. The only thing I'm really worried about is magic. Magic was pretty easy, at least to get runes was really easy. Not so much to get gear and armor, but to get runes and a staff, pretty straightforward. So we'll see if he went magic. We do have a super store and we do have a full inventory of blighted food and the 11 vengeance sacks, which we will of course change the spell book when we fight. But guys, we'll see how I did. I'll see you in the fight. Yes, yes. hi. 10,000 combat levels later. That was, um, that was a fun one. That was a fun one. How do you think you did? I was hopping around a bit. Yeah. Um, I think I did okay. I mean, like, I guess this is like every fucking challenge, but you're so at the mercy of RNG. Yeah. And yeah. <laughs> then like, like, so if you're going for an item and you spend a thousand comp level somewhere and you know you shouldn't have got it in a thousand, you're still sitting there thinking yeah. like, damn, that yeah. thousand did absolutely nothing for me. And it's like, do I stay or do I go? And I'm trying to kill monsters that drop multiple upgrades. So I yep. can get one of them. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Yes, yes, you know. It's a weird like, way to play RuneScape looking at combat levels. You're like, oh, I've wasted 4,000 combat levels. Like, what the fuck, you know? Yeah, and all the good items are like 1 in 64 <laughs> or, or rarer. Yeah. So you're sitting there like, like, do I just YOLO something? Or do I try to like play the, the mm -hmm. tight game where I just go for upgrades I know for a fact I can get. But yeah. obviously it's not going to be as good as like sending 5 Vorkath. Correct, well, yeah. I guess it could be... It could backfire, but maybe it won't. It's risk you don't know. versus reward, you know? It is. I'll tell it you, is. I got some unlucky RNG and some good RNG, so... I, I would say mine was just pretty, like, middle of the road. Okay, all right. I wouldn't right. say I got unlucky, but I wouldn't say I got lucky either. All right, well, hit us with the first item, dude, and we'll, uh, we'll jump into this. Go... Hmm. Let's go necklace as the first Ooh. item. <laughs> okay, all right. Uh... <laughs> The powering to oh no <laughs> uh okay let's go okay. let's go cape i don't have a cape <laughs> oh, <laughs> right i i thought for a second like how would you have killed jad like that's so many combat levels yeah, but right yeah. well, doing your fucking highway man i mean i guess it would have definitely been worth, worth it, doing mate. worth it five combat levels you know happy days <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's go let's go shield slot I don't have a shield. Okay. Where'd you get that from? Where'd you get that from? I got that from Revenant Dragons. Oh, you killed some Rev Dragons. Yep. Interesting. Yep. Okay. Decided to YOLO okay. for some for some equipment. See if I can get anything it. good. I respect it. Um. Okay. Let's go boots. No boots. Oh, okay. Killing. Killing jellies. Some jelly, yeah. I was actually trying to get jelly. a rune kite, so yeah. That Where was are you? At that point. Oh, I yeah. mean that 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 makes me feel fucking great. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So. Yeah. Okay. Holy shit. All right, all right. They right. <laughs> also dropped rune full helms. Let's say helm. Yeah. Did, did, did I didn't get a, get a helm form? either. That's what I was looking for. Oh, see now I'm just thinking you're going magic. Mm. Are you just like fucking playing me uh, right would now? I'd be wearing myth boots if I was going magic. I don't know. You might like have gotten like eight spells and your little backup plan with those know. boots. I don't know about that, mate. Um, Extra defense. Let's go, body. Oh, okay. Did he get the red. Did he get the red? <laughs> I got two Did. of them. I got two. Uh, this is where so I went dry. I, this is where I went dry. That's that's where you went dry. Yeah. Yeah. I honestly don't remember how many I killed. It wasn't a crazy amount, but. Right. Uh, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah. Not okay. Like, like, at this point, are we are we fooling anyone? Like, <laughs> it's unnecessary, you know. Well, I'll, 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 I, I didn't get one. I'll you just didn't tell you, I won't show you my weapon. I, I didn't get one. <laughs> How many did you kill? I don't remember. Like, this was like three days. Okay, ago. I've still got it in my tracker. I killed thirty six. Okay, I don't think I killed that many. Right. Okay. But... Oh. Mm. Oh, baby, mm. a triple. Okay. Very curious on the bolt situation. Yep. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't tell me yet, but yeah, I'm very curious in the bolt situation. Okay, so, you, so those you, don't come free. you gave up, I'm guessing. You are just like, fuck this, I'm not wasting any more. I didn't really give up. It was more of a sense of... So I really wanted the body in case you were going magic. Right, yeah. But I'm telling myself the rune crossbow would be a, a very welcome surprise if I got one. Right. Mm -hmm. But I don't know what you did. If I got the rune crossbow, I probably would have gone for like myth bolts because I would have had to kill like chaos druids. Right. Yeah, I would have they were on my mind for sure. Um, they were my so, backup plan. But yeah, as you know, I I did not get it. So wow, it was more really of a case of like I spent... I, again, I don't remember exactly how much. It really wasn't a crazy amount, but... After a bit, I was like, okay, in case he goes magic, I need to get like a like some sort of magic defense. I so guess I you killed got the power army out of it as well, and you sort of just took. One yeah, two. yeah, it was kind of like, okay, I did get an upgrade. Yeah, it yeah, wasn't yeah. Sun cost. Right. Let me just move on, sort of thing. Okay. Um. So. All right. Well, uh, your pick, mate. Let's go, legs. Uh, I'm not gonna like in this. Uh, this was some some disgusting oh, RNG. No. It's dragon, yeah. <sighs> but, okay. Was it Warcath? No. Or a red? No, no. He, it was a revenant imp. It's one in six k. Oh. <laughs> I killed one hundred twenty-eight imps. That's how I got my food and pots and shit. I rounded my food off with imps because they were definitely the best thing to kill. Yeah, they were. They were. And I was just yoloing it with dragon. Dude, that's how we got the legs, the shield, and the helm. From imps? No, no, no. Oh, from, from dragon. Okay, oh, I was yeah, about yeah, yeah, to yeah. say, Jesus Christ. No, 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 fucking no. That's just you. <laughs> that's just you. Dude, even during a group Iron Man, you yoloed like a fucking like ancient statuette three from an imp or some shit. From, imps. Three. from a fucking imp link. Um. <laughs> Yeah, I got it 10 KC, so I thought, fuck it, I'm just gonna stay oh. here and get everything sorted. It saved me a leg slot, so. Okay. Well, at least you have no shield, no helm. That yeah. makes me feel better. Yeah, I but definitely lose the defenses there. But... Mm. All right, um, kids, I'm not gonna lie, I've just got bolts, so I don't know if you're rocking anything else, but. Uh, nope. Okay. Let me throw on my weapon. Oh, where from? Rune Dragons. Wow, you I got a load of few. Because I, ha I got Rune Warhammer from the, the Rev Dragons. And I was like, that's not going to win me a fight. Yeah. And then I was thinking, okay, you know what? Let me just YOLO a few Rune Dragons. Got a Rune Longsword. And I was like, ah, still not good enough. I was actually going for the Plate Body, really. But right. I'm thinking again, like, Rune Long is an upgrade. The Rune Simi, the Rune Plate Body, and get Dragon. Yeah. So I And then I got the Simi, and I was like, you know what? It was worth it. I'm gone. So, Ooh. we got the Rune Simi, which I thought was actually pretty okay for this challenge. But after seeing you in fucking Rune Crossbow and... <laughs> I'm a red boy, mate. I'm a red boy. You are. But oh. again, I'm stoked to see that you're missing a helm. Yeah, I mean, definitely the the Dragon Plate Skirt does not make up for me not having a, a shield or helm. Definitely. I'm rocking 166 range defense. Uh, I'll take it. I've got 116 slash. So, yeah, you do, you do, okay. you do fuck me there. Um, Give me those bolts. Show me the bolts. Show me the bolts. Show me the bolts. Show me the bolts. I'll tell you right now, it's one KC, and I died getting the KC. So it's a very embarrassing clip. It's an incredibly embarrassing clip. That's 119 at Runeite. From what? Demonic gorillas, mate. They're one in twenty. Well, they're one in twenty to get 100 to 150, I believe. So I was like, that's a pretty good chance of getting some good rune bolts. So boom. Yeah, they also do drop the dragon simi as well, don't yeah, they? Yeah, so it was an all-round yeah. decent choice. Um, so yeah. Ooh, okay, I mean, I'm expecting you to have a pretty, you know, solid. Would have been silly to. I mean, we both know we we're at revs. Yeah. We both know we we're there. Only 11 sacks, but oh, I, you I know. mean that's gonna be enough probably. Yeah, if it's not, it'll be incredibly tail end to fight anyway. Yeah. So. Okay. But. All right. All right. Let's uh, uh love that cheeky little singular shark you got uh, there. I got, though, I got four from, from uh, Crazy Art. Crazy mate. Art. I was you tempted. Didn't, you didn't fill up with blighted from those imps you were killing? No, 128 imps, and that's I. I did get. I I got like nearly 30 food but 14 of them were crab ones so i was like fuck that I'm oh, taking that right, many right. so yeah that's why i've got a little shark there just to just to fill it out right cool all right man let's do it do it i'm good whenever you are I'm probably gonna i say we venge now all right let's let's venge, let's venge now 
Boom. And no, loves man. his pretty angle. Angle. <laughs> Angler. Angle. The Whatever angle. you already did. All right. Went Two second warning. Here we go. Let's do it. Come on. Let's hit like a train. That's not what you want to see. Not hit zeros. Ooh. All right. Okay. I'm just hoping the accuracy stays, man. Ooh, you know? Okay. Oh, oh it's a it's a naughty, naughty time. Oh my god. Oh god. This this might be bad. Oh that's bad. That's what? not ideal. I think it was your first bad hit. Pipe down, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but when already... you see a one, it's just like alright, like again, like really? Three. Necessary. Hmm. Come on, hit. Do I want anything out? No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, hit. Kins, Kins. We're yeah, going on a train. Crossbow. We are going on a train. I've got like so many balls I don't really need to worry about picking up these and G's, so we're good. We're good. Ooh, Ooh okay. okay. Oh, Come on. I'll probably do that just, just to make sure. <sighs> he breaks the vengeance instantly with that shit. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh, that's... Give me something. Ooh, that is not what you want to hit on a bench. Like a little, <laughs> little, little combo action there. Lucky it was a zero. Oh, my God. I don't even know what my sake. max is here. This is insane. We are popping off. Oh, my God. I didn't think you ate there. That was a delayed eat. Well, I have, I have the combos, so... Yeah. Oh, nice. Nice. A big old save for me there, but yeah, keep it interesting, dude. What the <laughs> fuck, <laughs> bro? With that venge, you know, you can just pop like a fucking. Especially when I can probably hit. Just, all right, if you're gonna keep saying that line, at least finish it. Holy fuck! <laughs> oh, see, okay. like that, and then a fucking like. Come recoil. on again, uh, again. Okay, this isn't as one sided as I thought it was gonna start. Oh my god. Come on, big hit. Ooh, yes, big hit. 22. Yes, say it again, Link. Say it again. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh. <Ooh. laughs> I didn't like that. I did not like that. That was not nice. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh, my God. Oh, 35. It's a good thing I brought lots of combo eats. Yeah, I'm actually could sort of do with that now because I'm sort of having to preempt it. Oh, fuck off with your fucking... Shit hits on the bench. I will say I'm pretty fucking accurate here. Yeah. Avenger. I'm surprised you're as accurate as you are. Oh my god. Yeah. It's something else. Come on. I, 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 the combo would feel so good. I can't hit. Every time I venge, I can't hit. Nice. Nice. Come of on. Of course. Come on. No, that's so poor. That's Ooh. so poor. Mm. I keep hitting, keep hitting. I don't know how this is going, to be honest. This is Slow like, and steady. This is getting a little bit worrying. <laughs> Slow and steady, boys. Surely not. Just smile and wave. Surely not. Smile and He's wave. He's got to be low. He's got to be low. Maybe. Oh. Yeah, no, definitely fucking not. Oh my god. Please. We could have a. Oh Ooh. my god. Eat, 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 uh, eat. Should I. Mm, no, no, there's no point risking it. This is our fight to lose. This is actually mental. How have you still got food? How. What? Easy. What? I, I... Oh my god. Oh my. Now he's out. Now he's out. He's done, Ski. He's so done. He's so done. Man, still going on a train here. Holy yeah, fuck. Yeah. Going on a train and it's going to Cincinnati, baby. Uh, Brown Town. <laughs> We're going to Brown Town. We're going to Brown Town. Dead. Dead. Lovely. Dude, how is that I'm that cool. close? Oh, it could have been that close. Come on. I have three food. Ooh. What? How? How? How is it that close? I feel like I was tearing you apart. That's 
That's so and dude, bad. and especially uh, especially the last like four hits you had. I think you hit like not the last. Uh, my last like three food you hit like fucking three out of four times, and they're all like twenty plus. Legit. As well. Like you were actually going into that before that train Ooh. up. That's madness. Well. Fuck. Bees and G's, if you want to see more of these, don't forget to drop a subscribe. Subscribe over to Rag as well. Um, and yeah, we've got like tins at this point, maybe like 500 challenges. <laughs> okay, it's not that much. Holy fuck. I think fuck, it might Link. be between us. I think no, 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 no. It's not 500. <laughs> With all the series and stuff, I think it it's might like be. It's like 250. Nah, he's lying, guys. You can go watch 500 PVPs. Be modest, right Link. Be modest. Five, 500 PVPs away <laughs> it's you guys. Not 500. Go, go watch some more. Good luck. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.